Happy Friday. I wouldn't say I'm in doubt, but sometimes, you know, frequently, every couple weeks, every month, I sit down to do one of these and I think, what the hell am I doing these for? And I know that they're for me, to some extent, as much as it is for anyone else, because as the words that come out of my mouth, sometimes I forget what I say after I say them. Um, and also, I also listen to the words that come out as I say them. I'm like, oh yeah, like that is, I need to take that advice. Uh, I need to apply that thinking because I forget. I mean, I, I have a built-in forgetter, you know, and that's part of the reason that I particularly like having a routine because for me, I get up, I do something, I do, it's, it's regimented and I'm able to evaluate my own behavior. You know, it's certainly not clinical, but it's, it's evaluatable. You know, I can see if I've done the same things every day uh, in my routine and I'm miserable, then maybe I'll adjust my routine. But generally speaking, if I get up, I meditate, I do a gratitude list, I do this thing, I exercise, I may not feel super great, but I, I am certainly set up for better circumstances than if I do, if I miss one of those things. If I miss one of those things, you know, sometimes all bets are off. If I don't do any of them, mm, I'm uncomfortable. So the built-in forgetter, I, I just, it's interesting to me. And the more that I do the same routine over, you know, throughout the days, I do remember. I remember more and more bits of it. But it doesn't negate the fact that I need to take the steps to get in line spiritually, emotionally, mentally, to step into the world. There's a lot of X factors all over the place. In the house, there's an X factor, right? I, the, there could be an earthquake, there could be a fire that I have nothing to do with, but I get to deal with them. Uh, you step into the world and everybody else has their own agenda, their own deal. And I have an opportunity to be as emotionally prepared for the day as I possibly can be when I go enter the world and I go be a part of we. It's my responsibility to take care of this thing, this thing. And then I can bring, it, it, it basically every morning I have to clean the filter. If I don't clean the filter and make sure it's not, or adjust my helmet, if it's not on straight or it's my filters are dirty and I'm thinking me, 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 mine, 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 and I go into the world, I'm a selfish prick. I'm in fear and I'm selfish and I need to figure out how to manipulate and get what I think I need to be happy, which I probably don't understand or know, or that's all mis and misrouted and, re and, and yeah. Versus if I clean, if I put my helmet on straight, which is my head and my, put my filters in, clean those, love, service, tolerance, honesty, my experience, my journey, my day, my life becomes wholly different. The ultimate control we have is our perspective, how we look at things. And I forget that. Sometimes minute to minute, sometimes second to second. But as soon as I remember, I get to readjust. I get to embrace gratitude. I get to remember where I've come from. Remember my journey. What's well, maybe that's the beauty of being human. We don't I don't we don't think that animals can remember necessarily their past or at least apply that kind of learning to it, but we as humans, we remember our story linear, linearly. 
if we have no memory problems, we linearly can look at our story. We set it up as a beginning, a middle, and an end. So I can look at where I am at now and where I've come from and where I'd like to go to. Much love. Have a fantastic Friday.